How long does it take for ozone to kill mold? Hello everyone. Today we're going to discuss a fascinating topic. How long does it take for ozone to kill mold? You might have heard about the use of ozone generators in mold remediation, but how effective are they really? Let's break it down step by step. What is ozone? Before we dive into the main subject, it's important to understand what ozone is. Ozone is a type of oxygen molecule, but unlike the normal oxygen we breathe, which has two oxygen atoms, ozone has three. It's a powerful oxidant that can react with many substances, including mold. However, it's also a strong respiratory irritant and can be harmful to humans and pets if used improperly. How does ozone kill mold? Now, on to the main question. How does ozone kill mold? Ozone attacks and breaks down the cell structure of mold spores, effectively killing them. This is why it's often used in mold remediation processes. However, there's a catch. While ozone can kill mold spores, it may not effectively remove mycotoxins, the harmful byproducts produced by mold. How long does it take? The time it takes for ozone to kill mold can vary, depending on factors such as the concentration of ozone, the length of exposure, and the extent of the mold infestation. In a controlled laboratory setting, it might take anywhere from a few minutes to several hours. But in a real-world scenario, with variations in ozone concentrations and conditions, it might take significantly longer, even up to a few days. Should you use ozone to kill mold? While ozone is effective in killing mold spores, there are important considerations to keep in mind. Ozone is harmful to humans and pets, so it's critical to evacuate the area before running an ozone generator. After the treatment, the area should be thoroughly aired out to allow any residual ozone to dissipate. In addition, ozone should not be the sole method of mold remediation. It doesn't remove the root causes of mold, like moisture issues, nor does it clean up the dead spores or mycotoxins. Therefore, it's recommended to use it in conjunction with traditional mold removal methods. To sum up, while ozone can kill mold, the time it takes can vary greatly depending on various factors. And even though it can be a powerful tool in the fight against mold, it should be used carefully and responsibly, as part of a comprehensive mold remediation plan. Remember, if you're dealing with a serious mold issue, it's always a good idea to consult a professional. Thanks for watching and stay safe.